Welcome to the Shikama Live Show with your host Shikama. Today we're doing a haul video. I've actually been trying to do this video. Uh, thanks. Thanks, Anubis. <laughs> For actually almost like a year. And uh, we're going to do this. So if you see any dust on the items, it's just because I just lost track of time and then I keep saying, I'm going to do this video, I'm going to do this video, I never did. So this is my bachelor. Home, what do you call it? Stuff you need for your house when you go out on your own. Sounds good? Right, that's... That sounds good. Okay, so first we have tumblers. This is for like orange juice. Mm -hmm. You don't need, always need a big cup. I do because I love orange juice. And that way I'm lazy and I don't like to go back and fill up a small drum. <laughs> I just pour me a great big glass of it. Okay, so what would you, half the time I drink directly out of the carton. Oh, okay. Because I live yeah. by myself. I Years ago I did a live stream. Uh, I decided that I would cook for myself, kind of, sort of, and, and not, and stop going out. And uh, we were just discussing that they did a huge study with like 20, 30,000 people. United States, half of them were supposed to eat the regular American diet, which included McDonald's and Burger King and all that sort of stuff. And they said, just keep keep eating like you were. And the other half, they put them on the Mediterranean diet. They followed these people over like 40 years. So like they got them like when they were like 20. And then uh, as they approached 40 and 50, they found that the people who were eating the, um, the typical American diet, uh, we're coming up with diabetes, heart disease, heart failure, and the people with the Mediterranean diet on the Mediterranean diet, which is uh, a lot of fish, a lot of uh, fresh vegetables, everything fresh, were not suffering from any of that stuff, none of it. And I told them how to follow it strictly, and they followed it strictly. They didn't see any of that stuff. They felt so bad the people started dying on the American diet uh, in their 50s. All sort of sort of sorts of complications. Uh, and so they stopped the study and told the people on the American diet, get off the American diet and go on to the Mediterranean diet. Because they felt so terrible that they were going to end up with half of their people in the study just dead. Anyway, so I decided I would cook for myself. And then I have bouts of going to, like once every two months or so, I'll go to a to a fast food restaurant or something like that. So anyway, here we're starting off with tumblers. Now I bought this for my orange juice, mm -hmm. but I end up drinking it out of the carton. You were saying you don't use these at all. I well I do if we're having people over for breakfast. And you want to appear? Appear like, you know, <laughs> I have a little bit of class, I'll use these. But on your own? On my own, I use a tall glass. <laughs> I, I love orange juice. I don't <laughs> drink it every day. And when I do drink it, I, I drink a tall glass of it. So, what are we going to drink the eggnog out of? Uh, and this or this? <laughs> I think we'll drink it out of this. I'm, I'm uh, bribing her with eggnog. You're going to drink it out of this? <laughs> okay. We're going to use up the quart, uh, what is it, half gallon of eggnog right tonight. Okay, so I'm going to wash these and, and, and so forth and so on. Okay, so I was on a weightlifting diet called a ketogenic diet. Uh, and it was steak and eggs at every meal. Oh, it's supposed to be broccoli too, but I never really. Steak, eggs, butter, and broccoli at every meal. The butter was for the fat. Mm -hmm. uh, and I use unsalted butter. You don't need to see butter, do you? Uh, and so the steak, I kept buying steak knives. And so I bought the cheap steak knives, and they were literally, they were like, Breaking. Uh, wobbling, breaking. So then I got a little bit better. Same thing. It wasn't that much better. So then I got these. So these are supposed to 
the professional steak knives. I, I got the uh, really thick wood handles and mm -hmm. I asked the cashier, which do you think is better, this with the wood handle or there's some like stainless steel steak knife? She says, go with the stainless steel. And she even said, I'm gonna go buy some myself because I need them. I only get four because I don't have friends. So <laughs> this, this was the smallest, that's the story behind that. Uh, I needed a container, so also the container is glass. Men have problem with plastic. I was trying to do a video before to tell all of you all to throw away your plastic stuff and uh, anything that touches your your food, like, like you eat out of or drink out of. Because uh, even if it's cool, it will still seep the uh, estrogen into the glass and it's not good for men or women but especially men it does all sorts of stuff so i bought glass containers is that what you call this mm -hmm. glass canister i don't know anyway all right next not the whole thing just Look, yeah yeah just one one at a time okay i bought this because my grandma had one Everybody's grandma has one. Everybody's gonna, what is it? It's to roast a turkey? Uh-huh. Or a chicken? Mm-hmm. Oh, and uh, was there anything special or it was just what was available at the time? Yeah, it's, it's what it was available. They do have electric uh, ones, but they're, they're bigger than that. They're and bigger than this? Yeah. This isn't big enough? No, that don't hold like a 20 pound turkey. Mm. And with no friends, you don't need a 20 pound turkey. <laughs> Isn't a smaller turkey better because it's not pumped full of hormones? No, they taste the same. They taste the same? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Oh, I don't have a place to put stuff. All right. Just the stuff in, on top. What's on top? top? Like, on like one or two at a time. So I think I got a few of these. I actually bake. I haven't done bread and I haven't done, I did meatloaf. It didn't turn out looking like anything like meatloaf. Nothing like, you know, the juice stuff. No, it looked like a shrunken cookie. <laughs> did, you, did you put eggs and uh, breadcrumbs and all that in it? I don't think so. That's why. Oh, that makes it mm -hmm. puff up or whatever? Okay, next time I make meatloaf, you're gonna come over, okay? Okay. It's funny, I can make three star meals, but those homey stuff, I don't. And the whole, yeah, that one. You want the whole thing? The whole thing. The whole kitten caboodle. All right. Uh, I have one of these, and this handle broke, oh, like, to here. I don't know what to, So I bought the same thing. No, I think this one is a little... feels a little bit tougher. And uh, I'm using the other one of these, because uh, that gets me in the habit of washing the dishes without washing the dishes. I, I go over with the uh, brush thing to knock off any big particles, and then I go over with the sponge. I use the sponge. I was supposed to have like a Brillo pad, but the, the, I don't know, I don't know what happened. And I have two of these. I don't know where the other one is. Did I use it? I think I used it the other day. And uh, you would be surprised, this tiny whisk comes in really handy. Mm -hmm. I had no, I was like, well, why? Uh, so, slotted spatula. And here's another one of these pan things. Why is it done? One of these pan things. Oh, you don't see anything. <laughs> like I said, if you see dust, follow me. Okay, so, uh, and I bought this at Walmart, and I said, my other, I have three sets of, you're going to see, I have three sets of uh, pans. These are called pans, right? Mm -hmm. And I said, my pans, I put them in the oven and they warp. And she says, I guarantee that 
these will not warp. Do all pans warp? I haven't used it yet. No, not all of them. So this is this is really sturdy. Yeah, it is. So it's, it's the same model as, yeah. as this, and this is really sturdy. So uh, see, of course I don't have lasagna in this thing. Mm -hmm. I'd be eating for a month. You don't need one that big for you. Uh, what would I do? In fact, I have a recipe that I'll give you, and it's like lasagna, but it's not lasagna, but it's as good as lasagna. Does it have the pasta, meat, mm -hmm. salsa, sauce? Mm -hmm. But it's not lasagna. No, you make it with just macaroni. Thank you.